Hello everybody, my name is Lickups, and welcome back to Terra. I know, it's been a while, but I wanted to get back to this since I haven't done an episode on this in a while, and the newest class in Terra is either out or will soon be out by the time you're watching this. And thus, there is reasoning for me to start getting, well, not to start, but to get back to this. And yes, I do realize that this first little bit has been, like, what you just saw was kind of a bit of a replay from, like, of the end of the last episode. But that was partially intentional, since it's been, you know, only a month. Well, no, by now it's been more like two months, almost since the last video, and I as well needed a bit of a reminder of where we're at. And we're currently pra learning how to, my how to take resources from things, like those rocks. We learned how to mine, use a pickaxe. Yay. Um, I, so, yeah, we're currently level 5, I want to say. I can't really, like, I, I have a, I, I can't really see all that much is going on when I'm doing these narrations. So, I'm going to say level 5. I could be wrong. Probably am. But we're just going to stick with that. Because I have no way of correcting myself as of this very second. And, yeah, so, just the other day, probably will be, will have been yesterday, from the t point I upload, upload this, we, the uh, first match of the League 1v1 tournament will have finished. That took a lot longer than expected, and it's a bit chaotic, but it's about the best I'm going to get when it comes to act, like, since... This, it need, like, if it's gonna happen, it needs to actually get done. Which means we can't spend two months between one, between one, game one and game two of the first match. And, uh, since it's gonna be best of three, which, uh, all I need is to get a chance to get Titan and Argot online and ready to 1v1, and that means no lag or anything like that, so that they can play their game too. Will it be the same spectators? Probably not. Will there be other spectators? There might be. But that's that. Meanwhile, we're killing these things. I was what I, what I'm doing here is I'm trying to check the range on this ability uh, on triple shot. I think is what it's called. Three something. I, I'm doing this off of memory since I can't actually since my view of this of what's happening is smaller than uh, it's about the size of well no it's smaller than the average YouTube window before you full screen it and thus I have pretty much no way to read the abilities since all the names are too small and I can really only see the numbers for um the numbers of how much damage I do for my critical shots. Which, it's, um, it's not the best thing, but it'll have to do. And, yeah. So we're just clearing these minions. Like, minion thingy. Well, you know what I mean. We're clearing these monsters. Eventually, we're gonna... Well, now we finished clearing them, and now we're going to have to climb up this obelisk thing uh, well, to climb up this area to get a plant. And I don't understand the point of having this part in the tutorial, because you don't face another one of these climbing, er climbing areas until level 28, I think it's around. And by that, I mean, that is when you get to the, to, I want to say, 
it's the second, um, I don't know the proper term, so I'm just going to call it raid dungeon thingy, since I don't really know what to call it. But yeah, once we get to the second raid dungeon thingy is when we're finally going to get to use that at press F to wall climb thing again. Now we're going to be climbing ladders, not vines. But that's going to be a while since that's 28, that's level 28, and we're still only at level 5 by now. But we'll get there in time. And, uh, yeah. There. We're, we just. One of, like, one of the biggest problems with, from, from my experience, one of the biggest problems with most MMOs, uh, with most MMORPGs, is that they make the distance you have to walk too long and your movement too, speed too low. And I get, I get it, ma the main point of that is to make it realistic, like, this is how long it would take somebody to actually walk all this distance. But... That's still, like, from a design perspective, it doesn't sound all that appealing, appealing in my opinion. Because there are, because, I, 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 even though I haven't gotten there, there will be parts later on where we, where we will do less fighting than walking. It will all just be, well, I should say riding, since it's got the steeds, but you get my, my drift, what I mean by that that we're going to be moving around rather than fighting most of the time. Which is actually where I'm going to say, later on, when we do get to that point, I am going to cut out all that long walking bit. And we're just going to jump straight to the actual action. But here, since there is a relatively... Well, it's not like this is the most invigorating action, but it's not entirely boring I mean it can kind of there, like there's a point to it and that is to help and that is to help uh, people new to the game get a grasp on how the game works and all that without exposing them to all the like to all the um, more complicated mechanics early oh also um by this point, by the by the point where I'm playing it, I don't realize what a lot of the abilities do, and I haven't figured out all the real combos yet. By the point I'm at, like by the point I've that's been recorded to, by the point I've recorded to so far, I actually do know relatively okay. Like this, like I use this ability, this one, this one. Enemy should be defeated. If not, just wait for another rotation of abilities. And uh, yeah, so hang like bear with me while we get through this area of I have no clue what any of this does, and because we'll eventually get there. And yeah. We just have to beat these things because, well, you know, I'll be honest, I don't really pay that much attention to the storyline of the game because there's just too much text. Like, yeah, sure, I like to read, but the, um, but when it comes to this kind of game, it just doesn't feel all, like, it just is a bit... Um, tedious to read all the little like words they say because most of it doesn't have any effect on the game itself anyways and really there's um, there's from my in my opinion there's very little point in reading much and, and reading on the lore reading on the kit reading all of the bits that they say and all that I mean I'll watch the clips but I'm not gonna really read that much and but I will 
take a little pause for a second every like most of the time I will take a pause for a second when there is a text thing so that anybody who wants can pause it read it and then play it again and wait for the next thing so you can read it obviously just I'm not gonna read it out loud I myself didn't actually read it yeah that's kind of just to clarify And there probably will be a couple times when I forget and I will just press, I will rush through the text faster than you can realistically pause it. But that I will try reduce when that happens. I've never, I never, I don't remember that attack that the um, enemy just did. I, 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 I just simply don't remember that they could even do anything like that. I thought that though that that type of enemy didn't have that sort of like any sort of built abilities along those lines. Well, it's a good thing to that I well no, no. it's it's yeah it's a good thing to watch this back again and talk about it for myself in terms of remembering what certain enemies do. Because later on, when I go back to recording, I'll be like, now wait, what does this do again? And, uh, how does that go? And what am I doing here? And, yeah. So, general, so it's just generally would, is good, would be good for me to do all of, to, um, do the voiceovers for all these episodes back to back and then record again and in fact that's probably what I am going to do just the thing about that is that I'm not necessarily going to um, do it all back to back since I I mean you can expect by the time this, like the day after this is uploaded, I should have a, uh, like my, my plan is the next day I'm going to upload the next episode of Pro Gamer Manager. And the reason why I'm doing these back to back for once, instead of, instead of my usual style of one a week, if I have the time, is because I'm recording this over the Thanksgiving weekend. I have a lot of free time right now although at the same time I have deceptively little free time because of I uh, extracurricular and just straight out curricular activities dealing with school I guess it's kind of obvious since I said curricular and extracurricular but shush shush don't question why I said that because really there's no reason that I say most of the things I say, other than to speak. And, yeah, we're just finishing up this quest right here, and now we level up again. We're level 7 now. That means we only have 58 more levels to go. And yes, I did just figure that out oh, in that second it took. I did not be like, note to self... On, on, a, on a little document, which I just read out loud. 50, when you hit level 7, say there are 58 left to go. That'd be a bit odd if I did do it. And that sounds exactly like a me thing to do, but in this case it isn't. But, yeah. So, we're back to being in the town center, and now we're leaving again so we can do... The, this next quest, which will, like, this next, uh, this next, we'll, we'll, the episode will end before we completely finish this quest. Because I believe that the quest ends, I believe this is one of the final quests, no, there are two or three more quests on this entire Island of Dawn, I could be wrong about that, but I think there only are a couple more. And we will end the episode once we have beaten five of these uh, 
I want to say Ogre Guardians. Yeah, Ogre Guardians. But, and that's one. Oh, that was a bit slow. I th expect me to take a tiny, like, to take, oh, okay, that was definitely a misclick. I, pro I was trying to hit I uh, th three there, but what I actually hit was four, which is what caused that cast. If I am correct, I think it's four. It could have been two. Either way, I know I was trying to hit three. And yeah, we just need to beat these last couple enemies before we end off the episode. And yeah, this should be the last one now so i uh, so thanks for watching uh if you enjoyed remember to like subscribe and comment for more and uh i now realize that there are a couple more seconds and one more enemy to beat so <laughs> jump the gun and we're just gonna beat this last enemy pretty quickly again with the misclicks hitting the wrong spell